have skirmishers running all around. Here, watching the city game, I guess that good. Right. Football season. I actually started, stopped watching football a long time ago. Especially like local football. It's a. It's a fuck. I mean, the football here is just um, comedy at this point. What happens on the field, really? Like we had like a, like this is like third or fourth league. I mean third and fourth league here, so it's like minus twenty. I guess you would say. And our goalkeeper, uh, someone like shot at a goal from like almost like midfield. And the goalkeeper was like running towards it to like kick the, uh, or kick the ball back. And he tripped. Well, he didn't trip. He slid because the. Um, actually, he's a lot of ammunition. What am I doing? Because uh, the terrain is so like fucked up. It's like and there's no grass on it anymore. It's just mud at this point. It slid, missed the ball. And the ball went into the fucking goal. And of course, uh, because people around here are, you know, good guys and they love everyone and we're peacemakers and all that. Jumped the fence. And the goalkeeper had to run for his freaking life. But those were the days. Shit like that. Dude, that's football. <laughs> When it comes to the, like biggest teams these days, I don't know. I, I, I like smaller teams to be honest. Follow the Rotterdam. Some days, seven or seven or eight years back, Fulham as well. A little bit. Do we need to ch We do need to charge this down, but there's too many of them. No, actually they ran away already, so they should be dead. I guess the only like international or like world club I always liked was the Bayern Munich and the reason of course is Oliver Kahn uh, that guy was the was the beast but I mean what can be better than a pissed off goalkeeper captain in a team <laughs> there is nothing better than that Then again, when he was was playing, I was a kid back then. I want you to go and die. Attacked us here. Uh, I could hold it. I cannot, and will not. They're not gonna do that. I shall go amongst them. Ready for battle. Set up the watch. Ready for orders. We actually have supply here now. N not really. Actually, we do. 
Up here at least. Uh, let's go. We got got food. Might be actually a good idea to go for two food. Yeah. Now, uh, by my logic, this is uh, for for settlement province. So we usually go with the military recruitment here. But I don't think we're gonna need more. We have Carthage. And we have realm, and I think I'm gonna grab maybe this, or like one more, like four province or four settlement province recruit from, maybe like up here as well. This is like pretty wide. You're gonna need to hold all this. And the barbarians come. Let's see what else do we need to upgrade or build? Oh God, everything takes so many turns. Uh, we might as well upgrade this. Actually, go for the. We don't actually have the money for the marble. Let's send the diplomats, though. You change your mind yet? Yes, they have. See if we can be friends with French. I accept the name of our people. I am eager to hear your embassy. Yo, come on now. It undoubtedly is by the wit and wisdom of Athena. You speak well and with. But they like me so much. Unfortunately, what you say is like a trireme without a ram. And they like me because I'm at war with the pirates. That makes sense. Wait, can I make peace? Since when can you make peace with pirates? What the hell? Of my oh, that's, that may be a problem that misclick is gonna do me go, go. at some point. Let me hear you. Right. Um, did I move the fleet? fleet yes, I did. How long do we need to wait for the Empire? Wasn't there like a date we need to wait for? Maybe not. Expansion plus minus 15. Empire maintenance plus 8. Research. I mean, gathering influence is going to be easy enough. We have so many family members at this point. Alright, let's see if we can get another settlement from Epirus, I guess. <laughs> That's gonna be fucking funny. If I just get all of Dalmatia from sending a, uh, a politician over there. Yeah, literally, look at that. We just need... Uh, I guess we can get this because this is... Wait, is it? No, actually, no. We could, could we could get the whole province, actually. That's gonna be something. Let's build the marble there. More trade resources. Reborn. Are you? We can agree here. 
If the spirits will... Nope. Actually, the Avernes might take out the Iberian tribes. Wouldn't be surprised. Nor the Iberian tribe might take them out, actually. What would be cool if you could if you could actually do a mega campaign in total war like you can in uh, paradox games like play total war realm 2 then attila then i guess age of charlemagne then medieval 3 if it ever comes out After that, what Empire and Napoleon, I guess. That's it. But that would be pretty interesting. Extra price five percent commerce tariffs. Now nah, we just need agriculture. Generous tribute. Look at that generous tribute. No wonder we got so much cash. I don't even need a lot of money in this game, to be honest. Can, well, I could run at the deficit. That wouldn't be an issue. Okay, just... Uh, actually... Right, we can't keep armies in the settlements. We cannot do that. Forgive me, but I cannot. At your command. Actually, let's bring you up there. You go down here. I mean, just getting this guy across here. He's gonna, he's gonna take damage. Oh god, I love, I love the desert, man. These are just sitting there. Could you, could you move? There. I need to place those somewhere. They're gonna start losing uh, supply. Okay, so let's see. War horse. I don't think I actually got that in the, in the faction, so let's grab that. I need to let these guys replenish a little bit. Let's see what's down here. Okay, it looks like they got another... I have a lot, to be honest. Although I like defenses up here are so weak. Good thing they didn't declare war on us, any of them. That here. Yeah, it's so freaking easy to make money. Real easy. After a while, like at the beginning, oh god damn. You can, like you can have one army and that's about it. Well, one better army, I guess you could say. If you want more, then you start losing. Bergamom. Yeah, let's send one diplomat to Bergamom. I think that we had good... Good outcomes there, for the most part. We hunger for battle.
Oh, well, hello there. Are you gonna try and take it back your capital? I don't want to see them try. Hmm. Should I set up an... Ooh. That might be an idea. Set up an ambush at Carthage again. See if they attack it. We can get an epic battle, but this time... Uh, Defend the city a little bit smarter than they do. Empty handed, reputation, famous bonding, public order. Well, women get killed too, apparently. Okay, so, Admiral, Admiral, three admirals. I mean, it is. They're gonna have a hard time getting through that one choke point from the... Uh, I guess they can... I don't think... No. I don't think the AI is gonna be that smart so they deploy in the actual, like, harbor area of Carthage. Hmm. It might take her out, actually. Yeah, they could actually, huh? Especially since there probably is another army there somewhere. So let's actually bring you back here. Send you across over there. Keep an eye on them. here anyway I'm gonna need more first and second class citizens for the Roman troops so I need to move them all the way back and look at all these guys with the ballistas or crossbowmen rank 9 right let's get rid of the pirates Or not. Peace. I'm thinking of actually moving the fleet up here. Granted, we could make another one as well. Although I would need to up my taxes. That's not good. I don't like the Egyptians moving anything my way. Although they are at war with Carthage. Uh, I guess they should move at some point against them.
have no clue where half of these are around the map. Right, has started in your capital. You suspect that it was instigated by one of the other political parties. Eh. The ship cannot go there. Because their fleets are just gonna chill there. Right, we do need to level these up. I guess we got some siege equipment now, so we might as well use that. Any mercenaries? Finally. Oh, sh I should have sit them in there, actually. Let's see about... Uh, Technologies. Kill Ranch. Six. What do we need? 30% plus culture from wealth. Political incident occurred. Collect cultural conversion. Our watch. Minus 12 upkeep costs for lower tier levy units, but upkeep costs for all units are increased. So why would you get this, to be honest? This range, Ex except like the plus 10 movement speed for all units. Mail attack for cav. Uh, let's upgrade the inf infantry all the way. Ready for orders. Advance on the move. Can okay, we move you back here? Oh, you're a fool. Never mind. I'm afraid we cannot. Move you here. Set up the watch. Oh. On the move. Forgot about the desert part. Yeah. No, it's kind of slow, but we can't really rush in because we have no supply. That's why I built this. But this guy. Can this guy secure a promotion? He doesn't even have. He doesn't even have a wife. Over out of money, never mind. Maybe I can start taxing this as well at this point. Yes, we can. Imagine if we could only like build watchtowers. Oh, that would be amazing. Well, nope, that's. I think the last. Yeah, the last time. Actually, I'm not sure if we can build watchtowers in Empire and Napoleon, to be honest. 
That's how little I played those games. Something about the combat always felt off in those. Actually, would be, would have been inf interesting if like my client state actually did something for once, but nope. Smart. Because if I attack any of these, they're just gonna run away even further. Can you get down there and recruit? Any more mercenaries? Nope. Rome needs more ships. How many turns? Six. We can take you out. I do hate that so freaking much. Moving out. Now I might be able to get them with the other fleets. That is the idea here. For this fleet that is. everything back here I'm not sure why but there's like why is there no more oh right supply crew lost them apparently like why there is no like uh, supply ships here or mercenaries anymore anywhere hmm ambush 60% chance I'll take it New patrol, I guess. Why the hell not? We hey, they're gonna leave themselves open. We lost he something here. But what? I'm not sure, but let's uh, buy another set of bowmen, I guess. Got that. Let's increase that. What else did I take? Movement speed all units, campaign movement range, morale during battles. Um. Just might as well just make him full on melee or like the red red category. My skills are your treading softly. We're gonna take that off cartridge in the next few turns, probably next turn. Well, actually not. I'm not sure if we can make it there in one turn. They are setting a couple of marmies our way. Ooh. Hmm. Ambushing. Four, five, five cav units and three elephants. Hmm. 
not the best of ideas, to be honest. Like they got an arch archer as well and a couple of uh, javelin men, I guess. It was right at the end. Oh yeah, this this. I guess we can use this to kill the bleeder. Okay, at least I know where to like place the Hastriarii to deal with the elephants, somewhat. What the hell is... Okay. Okay, I guess I'm not gonna put them there. Since this is impassable, the carrier should just charge at us there. Hopefully. I'm gonna use these to shoot at the elephants as well. Good. I only left them there. Jesus Christ. That almost gave me up. Ah, sure, that's fine. Bracing and enhance their ability to fight against cavalry. Um, I don't think that works versus elephants. I'm not sure. But let's not click it. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. What hidden units? God, those oh jeez. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Yeah, those elephants are gonna be a pain in the ass. Heavy shock cav versus heavy shock cav, who's gonna win? Oh, these are actually like high threat to them. Run, 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 run. I do love elephants. Who does not? Who doesn't? Isn't uh... move away? These are really after them. They got bigger fish to fry. up with the cab again. Can tell what troops they had there to be honest.
Get out of melee with those guys. Fuck six. Even worse. And those guys are really after my cab. Unfortunately, we do have to kill like all of them. All of their. Uh, Elephants. Brave Romans. Resolve like that in every battle at this point. squeeze them through so I can get rid of those slingers, whatever they are. Our general is under attack. Of course he is. I actually use stop firing the fire arrows at this point. Still have elephants about. Cricket pace, fling. Impossible. Yeah, like I said, the ambush here was was actually the. the, the I should have, like, just. I don't know. Spawn a little bit further away or something. Or set up a little bit further away, but said. are still at large apparently right shoot at the elephants actually you don't have any more ammunition Now this is what the Cav should do. Cycle charge. No wonder these aren't breaking. Heavy phalanx. Ooh, these are getting enveloped. That's not a good sign. Too many of my guys are actually tied up in the calves here. Caveats here. Oh god. Elephants versus calf. Who's gonna win? Look at that. Stop cycle charging for fuck's sakes. One of our units has used all its ammunition. At least their phalanxes are stupid and just staying there. Roma in Victor! 
He's running away again. God damn, the snowing. I want to charge. For fuck's sake, just charge him. Get them. St stick them to one like place. Don't start moving it around. Well, I guess you can't be mad about that. They're actually doing what they're supposed to, right? Those are actually gonna break. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Those who are broken finally. The battle is turning in our favor. Keep attacking that one. You come that way. Well, so much for the ambush going well for us. Those guys actually survive, which is amazing. Oof. Yeah, they didn't go as planned. At least we can replenish all of those pretty quick. I hope so, at least. release the captives. Or actually, ooh. Yeah, I might need to move them all the way back to replenish them, actually. But we do have another army sitting up there to move in instead of them.
be able to make a campaign like I said. Oh, that would be interesting if they could make that happen. From Rome to Empire. That would be something. But I mean, I guess... Uh, I guess that can't work because uh, in each game you would conquer the whole map. Turns. It might be faster to get them back, to be honest. Move those up there. We hunger for battle. Can we attack that this turn? I think we can. How can I be as you can? But they are moving a couple of armies our way. Let's see that. Forming a blockade. Come on. Let them cower before Rome. <laughs> I mean, I already beaten one of these armies in one siege, so let's uh, all resolve this. They sent a couple of armies this way. Uh, I'm not quite sure where they are at this point, but they're there. Swift and silent as a shadow. Move those. I am going to need to send an army up there at some point as well. I guess this is going to be the relation. Or like, where do we send it from? It is an honor to serve Rome. Eight turns. Let's move those out. I got another fleet some right these ones. They should be replenished faster at Syracuse. Or not. Let's keep him there anyway. Okay, at least there's not a settlement there or something. We need to capture like this one. These two. Jesus. I don't want to go into the, into the desert. Yet. Right. Uh, let's send the... Politicians over to see if he can grab some money, then we're gonna deal with that. I'm sure, one to Epros, one to Egypt. Let's see, another one, uh, Sparta, why not? Deco, what could you do without that, man? Yeah, let's go for the morale bonus. melee defense well, well, 
No, apparently they're moving their armies back now. I could actually just uh, set up my armies into an ambush, ambush stance everywhere. <laughs> Considering how that last ambush went, uh, let's not do that. find ourselves matched against a worthy foe your strength you haven't moved so fuck you Research rate. <laughs> See? See? This is how you get settlements. <laughs> oh god. Um, actually, food is going to be a problem here. This is how you do it. So we're gonna need the uh, aqueduct and the temple. What's up? Juventus? How's it going? What do I want to grab here? I guess we are going to be expanding this way some at some point, so let's build that. We just got territory by diplomats or politicians. Easy. I do want emperors, though. Or their territory. Now yeah, we're doing fine. Well enough... Uh, this faction declares war on me. Or actually, not just that faction. Like, a couple of them. There's one up here as well. I'm not sure which one. Yeah, these ones. Carthage gives them money to attack me. You know, to join the war against me. And I uh, give them a peace offer and take that money for myself. <laughs> so we're doing pretty well. And then in real life, I mean, Welcome. we can always do better. Okay, that's built or finished up. We get timber there and I guess food. Of course, these guys are gonna raid. God damn it. Now I gotta go after them. They're not actually sitting in the garrison. No, they are not. Good. Let's actually lure, lure them in here, but from this side. Yeah, that's probably not gonna work. They have a spy right there. Can we? we have a low chance to do that either way. Agent up there.
It's gonna take a while for these guys to replenish. Actually, to be honest, like this area here is gonna be a pain in the ass to conquer. It's, I mean. Uh, I'm, hopefully I'm gonna get a uh, peace agreement with these otherwise it might be an issue I would need to raise two more armies to actually deal with all that Diplomat has a silver tongue. He managed to finagle you a settlement. <laughs> I honestly didn't know that was a thing before because I was like never sent anyone on a diplomatic mission. Nothing happening. Famous color. Someone died. Yeah, well, literally, like, we got both of these without a fight. And we just got. Um, Cyrene here with all the fight. <laughs> Who needs armies, man? Just 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 send the dipl diplomats across the world. It's that easy. Could you run away further? Come on. Oh my god, that, that, that spy didn't actually see my army there. Amazing. I'm gonna send him down here because I've seen the AI do stupid shit. They might appear out of nowhere there to attack that. Make haste, men. Move you this way. Let's see how long it is going to take for you to replenish. And oh lovely. Looky there. Fucking pirates. We can't reach him. Please this turn. No, I do want to send a fleet back down there in case we got to get attacked from that side. These guys can hold the line pretty well. Just send diplomats across the world, man. 